Join match. Marker. Lugia is very bad in dark. <laughs> you not enjoying it. <laughs> Versus. I'm gonna write down Lugia. We'll find out if I'm right. Lugia, mate. Bloody Lugia. Hello, love. I'm from Lugia. You know what I mean, chat? You know what I mean? <laughs> Snap back to reality. Oh, there goes gravity. Wait, if I'm going first. <laughs> oh, no, it's Moon! My boy! That's my boy. All right, well. Annoying, but I understand. Martin, Martin, talking about Martin. All right, let's go. Ah, oh, you're fucking kidding me, aren't you? It's in hand. That is deeply upsetting. Deeply upsetting. Okay. Uh, all right, we've got a lot of work to do here. But if anyone can do it. I mean, maybe it's me. I can't guarantee anything. Uh, we'll go with these two. Then I think I would attach this. It's incredibly tempting to play that down. But the problem is I don't want to put this into play. Because that benefits opponent. And we don't wish to benefit opponent. We also don't want to leave my right on the active. That would be silly. <sighs> oh, this sucks. I don't know if that's right at all. <sighs> also, I don't think I can play the next round. No worries. If we get to you and uh, you're not available, that is absolutely fine. Oh, for fuck, they had it anyway. Come on. <laughs> well, I did I, I did once actually time how long it took me to find something hideously personally offensive is about eight seconds. I just let I just let it ride on Twitter. Like I, I use the for you page all the time. And it's mostly Pokemon, which is nice. Occasionally I get a lady's bottom. But other than that, I'm not too concerned. Don't I own me? I kinda like that hand. JK, I hated it. Lo, 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 lo. Oh my god, this is no better. <laughs> I mean, I mean, we got this, but. So, it's not impossible, but because Iona was used rather than Sarda or Research, it's not easy from here to get a Roaring Moon ready to go. It's not impossible, but it's not easy. I think the energy will be there in the discard. But you need to see a manual, a die flames, an NG switch, dark patches, and the way to swap as well. There's a lot required. Is what I'm hoping. Like, I know this matchup fairly well. I generally have a good matchup into it. The switch going's big. There's only two energy here. The double dark patch can happen. Energy switch can happen. There's a lot to dislike here. Die flame hasn't been used. Forest seal hasn't been used. It's not the end of the world if we lose Maridon. I would simply rather not. Dire Flame into more Peko for the retreat later is an absolutely solid idea here. It's unlikely I'll get Iron Hands going. Now, if Iron Hands was on the board with an NG or two on it, maybe you worry a little bit. But right now, Iron Hands isn't a threat. So that is an absolutely fine turn. That's not to say I can't find a way to do it. But it's an absolutely solid turn. So. 
Speak of the devil, and he will appear. Grab you, grab you. Town stall. Grab this. Pop her in. We want to... We need to keep this for the retreat. In fact, let's do something like this. We're going to lose this anyway. <clears throat> We're going to lose this anyway. What we need is a pivot. But we'd also like the Mareep. Honestly, having UX in this situation isn't the worst idea for the restart afterwards. So, let's go MUEX. Play that down. Switch into that. Then we attach... Here. Yoni. I shouldn't have attached. I've got Forest Seal available. That was stupid. Let's go full greed. Yeah, with Forest Seal, I shouldn't have attached. Somehow we've gotten away with it. That's incredible. Uh, we'll go for this. Then we restart. <clears throat> would I... Yes, I would. We have the option to do more later. Grab the fluff. Treats. Save the line, chat! Ah, thank you very much. Do you think Twitter or Reddit is worse? Um, probably Twitter, right? I think most people would say Twitter's worse. I haven't got a particular dog in the fight. I'd definitely say one is worse than the other. I need to do a quick little bit of research on this list. Uh... Okay, so the capture could come in handy. Yep. <laughs> so this needs to be answered with a frenzied gouging. This is why Brute Bonnet was like in the early lists of Roaring Moon. It only hitting for 220 is really frustrating. We should be able to respond to this fairly well. Now, is there a switch? The real issue we have right now is we didn't set up any EXP shares. They would have been massive. We just didn't have the option to do that, and that's fine. We can still work around what we need to do. The nice thing is we can now respond with a ride on. If we're feeling saucy, we could reply with Zapdos. <laughs> we don't even need to put a two-prizer into the active. We're probably going to have to. But there's a... There's a a play that stops us from even needing to. But the problem is you need to hit what you need to hit, you know what I mean? So, let's play it sensible. We'll do this. Then... Dynamiter. Let's just get Zapdos ready as a potential attacker later. It does hit for both Squawk Billy and Greninja. Uh... I would switch. I would then town store. <laughs> Get an EXP share. Pop it on Zapdos. Uh, would you tandem unit for something? I don't see why you wouldn't. I think it's worth putting that threat back into the back into availability. Then restart. Then you go, ugh, this isn't anything. <laughs> you go Star Alchemy. <laughs> Grab one of these. There are plenty of resources for us to play with here as well. Very happy with that. EXP share. For the generator. Incredible news.
Now, uh, Fluffy and a manual attack from either Iron Hands or Zapdos being able to attack. And Photon Blaster just takes a knockout here. If we get knocked out, we've got EXP share on both Zapdos and Iron Hands. Plus Dynamota. We are in a win. winning position either way now. If Morizon had any kind of like easy, not easy way, but like a, a, anywhere near a 50-50 matchup to Charizard, I could see myself picking up Moridon. Like, it's such a fun deck. Such a fun deck. None of it compares to the most terrifying website on the internet, which of course is DeviantArt. I don't know, have you been on Vampire Freaks recently? I haven't, but I imagine it's scary. I've not been on Habbo Hotel recently. <laughs> <coughs> any Bebo mains? Ugh. I will say this much, this Maridon has played perfectly. Like, other than... The only potential misplay we made was not using Town Store and Drapion early on to establish more of a board setup. Like, what I would have done in that situation is throw down Town Store, throw down the Drapion, Forest Seal, grab the Squawk ability, then get the hand going. It turned out we didn't need to. What we feared was already in hand. And it didn't actually end up mattering anyway, which is nice. So, we're actually fine. So here's the here's the thing. Two ninety isn't impossible to hit, but it's a real pain in the ass. Uh, I th we have to attach to you, don't we? Actually, to you. Oh, no, actually, we've got... We've, we haven't definitely got game, but we're pretty damn close. We're pretty damn close. That, that should be game. So, you go there. Dynamota. Attach to Raichu. Retreats. And Dynamic Spark. For the final two cards. I completely understand why Maridon players are relatively confident they've got like a really good matchup into Roaring Moon. Because they do, if it runs like that. that. Well, that was incredible. We hit Generator every time. But like, that doesn't always happen. And it's such a frustrating deck to play when it doesn't hit those Generators. The fact that it all hinges on Generators... I, I just don't like the deck at all. Ah, oh, GG Milky, GG. That was a... Uh, 